international community. They recommended interventions from stakeholders to promote transparency and accountability. Uh, stakeholders in the agri sector want to research into food security scaled up in the sub-region. Now, the call has become necessary due to a seeming food shortage in parts of the region due to sudden climate shocks. Data provided at the Maiden edition of the Science Symposium organized by the West African Science Service Center on Climate Change and Adapted Land Use, WASCAL, indicated that research into food security had waned. Speakers advocated deliberate moves by African government to ensure that food supply is not threatened. Deputy Minister of Science, Technology and Innovation, Patricia Apiede, says government has plans to promote research in the sector. The coming into force of the Paris Agreement in November 2016, for example, imposes strong commitment on signed members in terms of setting and honoring their nationally determined contributions. Executive Director of WASCAL, Dr. Mumini Savadogo, is optimistic the conference will produce the needed solutions to prevent regional food shortage. What we are trying to do is to build real network where we can complement each other because especially if you look at uh, uh, science and edu higher education and then climate services provision, uh, these are very key for West Africa, as you know. We need to network with everybody so that we pull together all our efforts, our results, and then translate them clearly to actions. Other speakers recommended a collaboration between member countries to promote agriculture and scientific growth. We're still live here on News 360. Let's now take a look at our MTN Vigi reports this evening with Cynthia Atanga reporting from the Upper East Region. Sazudone Primary School in Sirugu Basengo, Kasnana Kana West District. The school was established in 2011 and since then had no structure. The staff has decided to use one room of a toilet which was built by World Vision as their office to keep their materials 